Hello, everybody. Welcome to our mental health with a biblical perspective series. Today, I want to talk about mindfulness and how mindfulness can help us with our spiritual health. Our spiritual health is very important because it will also affect our mental and emotional health. Have you ever faced the challenges of being still and present with your God? You know, as you read your Bible, as you pray, do you feel distracted with the constant busyness of this world? Or do you feel like worries comes to your life and it drags you away from learning to be still with God? Or sometimes there are many things that we want to do, urgent things that comes on again and again, and we feel like, yes, I got to do all these things. Or it could be we're just plain lazy. All these things drag us away from our spiritual health, our spiritual walk with God. So today, I want to talk about one method that we can do to help us grow in our spiritual health, which will affect our mental and emotional health. Let me read from the book of Psalms, chapter 46, verse 10. He says, Be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I will be exalted in the earth. God says we need to learn to be still. Learn to be present with Him. And when we are present with God and when we are still with God, then we can see the awe of God. We'll understand that God is exalted among the nations and that He is exalted in this earth. And when we sense that presence in our life, it will really help us in our spiritual health, our mental and emotional health. So the one method that I'm going to talk about that will help us to learn to be still, to learn to be present with our God, to improve our spiritual health is mindfulness. Mindfulness, the meaning of it is basically learning to be present right here and now. Isn't that what we need when we want to spend time with God? We want to be present right here and now so that as we study the Bible, as we pray, we won't be distracted by the urgent things, by the busyness of our life. So today, we're just going to do a simple mindfulness exercise. I call this following your breath. And if you are willing, let us do it together. First, find a comfortable place that you can sit and uh, sit up straight. And I'm going to direct all of us through this mindfulness exercise. So you follow my instruction. And there will be at times where I will pause for a certain time. So when I pause, just keep doing what you've been doing. Okay, don't open your eyes, don't get distracted. Just continue the mindful exercise. All right, so let's get ready. Okay, so find a comfortable place, sit upright, let your feet rest on the floor. And uh, right now, let us start by closing our eyes. And as you close your eyes, I want you to follow your breath. Follow the air that you breathe in and as you breathe out. And as you follow your breath, can you feel how the breath moves from your nostril into your tummy? And then follow your breath out from your tummy, out into your nostril. Follow it as if you're following an, the atoms of your breath. In and out. Now, if you are 
getting distracted or if you are worried about whether you're doing what's right, just notice those thoughts, those feelings and continue to follow your breath. You don't have to do anything with those thoughts and distraction. So continue to follow your breath. Follow the air all the way in your tummy and all the way out. And as you follow your breath, can you feel your breath? Is there any special sensation? Do you feel your tummy going out as you breathe in? Do you feel your tummy going in as you breathe out? So let's continue to follow our breath for a little while and I'll just pause from speaking and I'll continue in a short while. Do not open your eyes. Just keep following your breath. Let it flow in. Feel your tummy going out. And let it go out. And feel your tummy going in. Is your breath warm? Is your breath cool? Just notice them the temperature of your breath as you breathe in and as you breathe out. Let's do this for a little while. Again, don't open your eyes. Just keep following your breath. If you notice some distraction coming in, worries, wondering whether you're doing what, is it right or wrong, it's okay. Just notice those thoughts and those feelings and continue to follow your breath. I want you to notice how your breath goes in all the way to your tummy and your tummy inflate out and as you breathe out, I want you to notice how your breath moves out of your lungs to the outside. Let's just keep doing this for a little while. Don't worry if you are wondering if you're breathing normally or if you're breathing too fast or if you're breathing too slow. It's okay. Just notice those thoughts and just keep following your breath. Okay, now I want you to slowly, as you follow your breath, to open your eyes. 
All right, that's the mindfulness exercise called following your breath. Now, I want you to notice something. What do you notice right now? Your experience, your feelings. Do you notice a sense of stillness, a sense of quietness? Mindfulness can help you to learn to be still and quiet so that you can focus on your time with God the next time as you study the Bible, as you pray. So this is one exercise that you can do to help you to do before you have your quiet time so that you can learn to be present with God and improve your spiritual health that will affect your mental and emotional health. Now, in doing this exercise, I also want you to notice, was there any difficulties like distraction? Or was it easy? For some of us, it's very easy. And for some of us, you might find it challenging. And that's okay. Again, you don't have to do anything. It's just to notice those challenges or notice how easy it was for you to do this, to do this particular mindfulness exercise. All right, thank you brothers, sisters, friends for this time together. I'll see you again, bye.